This is my take on fried rice. It's very easy and very few ingredients. This is everything you'll need. And you don't need to use liquid aminos. You can use soy sauce, which I will be using. Here we go. So I cooked three cups of rice with five and three fourths cups of water. And then once it was done cooking, I laid it out on a griddle so it can cool and dry. This is the kind of bacon I buy. Um, but you can use an entire pack of regular packaged bacon. But whatever you'd like, it doesn't have to be this much. And I'm just going to cut it into chunky strips. Also going to dice one large carrot, which should equal to one cup. One cup of diced carrot is the perfect ratio for this recipe. Okay, add your bacon to a skillet or wok. I'm using a wok. And once they're halfway cooked, you're going to add your diced carrots. If your carrots are smaller than mine, add them later because you want them to finish cooking at the same time. And then you're going to take about six cloves of garlic. And I'm just going to chop enough to make two tablespoons for this recipe. Chop up some cabbage, which should give you about a cup to a cup and a half. And you're going to add it to the bacon and carrots once they look like this. And I know that looks like a lot of oil, but you need it, trust me. And add the garlic as well. I also added a teaspoon of sesame oil here, but I forgot to record it. I'm really sorry. Afterwards, you're going to add one cup of frozen peas and mix that around. Here, I just cracked four eggs into a bowl and scrambled them really well. Added them to hot oil, preferably neutral oil, and cooked them all the way through. So just set that aside and then begin to add your rice to your veggies and bacon and I'm using a spatula in order to avoid smashing the peas or mushing up the rice and I'm just breaking up any clumps of rice that I see. So I'm just adding soy sauce until the color looks right to me and the flavor is right to me. I don't really measure my soy sauce or liquid aminos whatever it is I'm using so it's your preference. Do as much or as little as you want. You'll add your eggs last and slice them into the rice with the spatula carefully. Continue flipping this over and over until the color is to your liking. And this is the final result. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you love it.